a Nigerian born professor of pharmaceuticals nanoscience, Ujoma Uchegu, has been appointed as the seventh president of Wolfson College, a constituent college of the University of Cambridge. According to the institution, she is set to assume the role on October 1, 2024, succeeding the current president, Professor Jane Clark. Clearview News in Mofonokon beams spotlight on the profile of the special breed. Professor Ijo Mauchekbu, currently holding the position of a professor in pharmaceutical neuroscience at University College London, has a route from southeast Nigeria and Hackney. Commencing her pharmacy studies in 1981 at the University of Benin, she pursued a master's degree at the University of Lagos. In country infrastructure limitations, she couldn't finish a doctorate in Nigeria. After returning to the UK, she undertook postgraduate studies at the University of London, culminating in a PhD in 1997. Subsequently, she served as a lecturer at the University of Strathclyde from 2002 to 2004. Professor Uchebu is currently a professor of pharmaceutical nanoscience at University College London. Her innovative research on drug transport mechanisms has contributed to the development of new treatments. Her work has garnered numerous awards, fellowships and approval. She also holds positions on several academic boards and councils, including the Wellcome Trust, the Academy of Medical Sciences. During her tenure at University College London, she played a key role as Pro Vice Provost for Africa and the Middle East, forging new research partnerships in those regions. You need to be able to take the disappointment. The one thing that's certain about life is not success, but it's disappointment. Everybody will have a situation where they've gone for a job, they didn't get it. They went for a place on a particular course and didn't get it. What separates the people that are actually considered to be huge successes later and the people that didn't quite make it is the fact that those that are faced with disappointment put that disappointment behind them and battle on. So you have to be able to stand up when you've been knocked down. That is, I think, very, very important. It's the only thing that separates the people that you may look up to in different fields as being hugely successful from those who tried but didn't quite make it. It's the, it's the ability to stand up when you've been knocked down. If someone says to you that it's unlikely that you're going to get this amazing job that you want to get in this very high performing environment, think about that as a challenge. Think that what you're going to do is that you're going to get that job, then you're going to ring that person up or you're going to send them some Instagram of you at your job so that they know that you've been able to achieve it. So you really need to have passion and desire, the desire for it, because if you have that desire, you're going to throw everything at trying to achieve your goal. Meanwhile, President Bola Metinibu has congratulated Nigerian-born professor, describing her as an excellent ambassador for the country and for a relentless effort to advance the frontiers of pharmaceutical science even as President assured Nigerians in diaspora that his administration remains committed to building a robust interface mechanism that enhanced ideas, promotes investment opportunities, and strengthens bonds in line with his 4D foreign policy. It may interest you to know that a Nigerian born professor of pharmaceutical nanoscience, Ijo Amaucheku, is now the seventh president of Wellington College, one of the 31 colleges of the University of Cambridge. Imefonokun reporting for Clevy News.